Readings for the day, 2022, on Thursday, December 15th. The readings from the regular cycle, the epistle, Thursday of the 27th week. The reading is from Paul's first letter to Timothy. Timothy, my son, charge the rich in this world not to be haughty, nor to set their hopes on uncertain riches, but on God, who richly furnishes us with everything to enjoy. They are to do good, to be rich in good deeds, liberal and generous, thus laying up for themselves a good foundation for the future, so that they may take hold of the life which is life indeed. O Timothy, guard what has been entrusted to you, Avoid the godless chatter and contradictions of what is falsely called knowledge. For by professing it, some have missed the mark as regards the faith. Grace be with you. Amen. The Gospel, Thursday of the thirteenth week of Luke. The reading is from the Holy Gospel according to Mark. At that time... The disciples kept the word of Jesus to themselves, questioning what the rising from the dead meant. And they asked him, Why do the scribes say that first Elijah must come? And he said to them, Elijah does come first, to restore all things, and how it is written of the Son of Man, that he should suffer many things and be treated with contempt. But I tell you that Elijah has come, and they did to him whatever they pleased, as it is written of him. And they went, they came to the disciples, they saw a great crowd about him, and scribes arguing with them, and immediately all the crowd, when they saw him, were greatly amazed, and ran up to him and greeted him. The readings for the commemoration the epistle for the saint. The reading is from Paul's second letter to Timothy. Timothy, my son, do not be ashamed then of testifying to our Lord, nor of me his prisoner, but share in suffering for the gospel in the power of God, who saved us and called us with the holy calling, not in virtue of our works, but in virtue of his own purpose and the grace which he gave us in Christ Jesus ages ago, and, ha and now has manifested through the appearing of our Savior Christ Jesus, who abolished death and brought life and immortality to light through the gospel. For this gospel I was appointed a preacher and apostle and teacher, and therefore I suffer as I do, but I am not ashamed, for I know whom I have believed, and I am sure that he is able to guard until that day what has been entrusted to him. Follow the pattern of the sound words which you have heard from me, and the faith and love which are in Christ Jesus. Guard the truth that has been entrusted to you by the Holy Spirit who dwells within us. You are aware that all who are in Asia turned away from me, and among them Figulos and Hermogenes. May the Lord grant mercy to the household of Onesiphorus, for he often refreshed me. He was not ashamed of my chains, but when he arrived in Rome, he searched for me eagerly and found me. May the Lord grant him to find mercy from the Lord on that day, and you well know all the service he rendered at Ephesus. The Gospel for the Saint The reading is from the Holy Gospel according to Mark. At that time, Jesus was going through the grain fields, and as they made their way, his disciples began to pluck heads of grain. And the Pharisees said to him, Look, why are they doing what is not lawful on the Sabbath? And he said to them, Have you never read what David did when he was in need? and was hungry. He and those who were with him 
how he entered the house of God when Abiathar was high priest and ate the bread of the presence, which is not lawful for any but the priests to eat, and only and also gave it to those who were with him. And he said to them, The Sabbath was made for man, not man for the Sabbath. So the Son of Man is Lord even of the Sabbath. Again he entered the synagogue, and a man was there who had a withered hand, and they watched him. So uh, they watched him to see whether he would heal him on the Sabbath, so that they might accuse him. And he said to the man who had the withered hand, Come here. And he said to them, It, it is lawful. Or, and he said to them, Is it lawful on the Sabbath to do good or to do harm, to save life or to kill? But they were silent. And he looked around at them with anger, grieved at their hardness of heart, and said to the man, Stretch it out. And his hand was restored. It is appropriate to stand for the reading of the Synaxarion. Synaxarion from the Manaion. On December 15th was the contest of the Holy Hieromartyr Eleftherios. On this day, St. Anthea, mother of St. Eleftherios, died by the sword as she was holding her son's dead body. On this day, St. Coremon, the eparch died by the sword after he believed in Christ and was baptized. On this day, the two executioners who believed in Christ died by the sword. On this day was the contest of the devout martyr Saint Susanna. On this day, we also commemorate the holy martyr Eleftherios the Chamberlain. On this day, we also commemorate the holy martyr Bacchus the New. On this day, we also commemorate our devout father Paul the New, who was an ascetic on Mount Latrus in the days of Emperor Constantine Porfirio, Porfirio Genitos. By the holy intercessions, of your saints, O God, have mercy on us and save us. Amen. Fasting rule, wine and oil are allowed. Remain, uh, refrain from meat, fish, dairy, and eggs. It is the Christmas fast.